shoulder active range of motion. So I'm gonna get you to move your arms in a few different directions. Let me know if you film this, if there's any directions that feel painful or tighter than the other. You can also take photos, but a video will just be quicker and it works just as good. So I'm gonna get you to sit with your arms at your side and the first movement will just be raising them straight up overhead. And then I'd love to see that from the side angles. Ideally having your whole spine in the, in the video as well it is helpful for me. The next movement will be abduction. So you'll be raising the arms out to the side like this. If you're doing a jumping jack, we'll see that from the side as well. The next direction is external rotation. So you'll bend both of your elbows to 90 degrees and then rotate your hands out. Same thing from the side. I also want to see that movement with your arms up here, rotating back. Everything's at 90 degrees. The next direction will be internal rotation. So you'll actually face away from the camera. You're gonna put your arm behind your back and then switch. Another way we can look at internal rotation is from the side angle with your arms up at 90, 90 again, and then rotate down. 